Hey YouTube, it's ICU, and today I want to give you guys the status on the iOS 4.3 untethered jailbreak and the unlock for current base bands. So first of all, if you have not watched my video that I posted yesterday, be sure to click on the annotation that's on the screen now to go ahead and watch that video first, and then you can come back to this video and continue watching it. Now, there will be a pause here pretty soon, and make sure you just click on the annotation that says skip pause to go past the pause and continue watching this video if you have already seen the video that I posted yesterday. All right, so I have a post over here on my website, besttechinfo.com, and it is titled iOS 4.3 Jailbreak and Unlock Release Info. So basically, I'm just going to go ahead and read this verbatim because I just typed it up to answer your questions, and I'm making this video to answer your questions as well. So legendary iOS hacker Comex, along with numerous other hackers, have been working like crazy to bring us the best possible jailbreak for all iDevices on 4.3. This includes but is not limited to the iPad 2. So yesterday's post was talking about how Comex and Ionic are extremely close to completing and releasing the jailbreak. After I posted that and made the video on it, I was flooded with comments asking for a release date. So I made this post and I'm making this video as well to answer that question. So this has been taken straight from the description of Ionic's video and again that video was the one where he demonstrated the jailbreak on a first generation iPad and it says because so many people are asking for an ETA I am sure that the untether will be released before the next weekend. I was using old kernel patches that caused lagging on jailbroken devices. I will change that and then port it to other devices and release. So Comex also hinted yesterday that the jailbreak will be released soon. So when someone asked him if jailbreak me 3.0 is coming out uh, because they have already jailbroken the iPad, he replied and said, no, it will take some work to package it into a jailbreak. Same deal as Ionic. So basically this quote up here that I was talking about that Ionic said, uh, it stays true to what Comex said as well. They just have to work out some of the kinks in it and also package it up and put it out for a release. So uh, that should be relatively soon. Now, as for the unlock, I get boatloads of people asking me about the unlock for the latest baseband's. All I can say at this time is that I don't know when an unlock will be out, and I do know that you should not upgrade to a stock 4.3 IPSW, which is just the stock Apple firmware for 4.3, because it will upgrade your baseband. So that is the key thing to be sure that you do not do do not upgrade to a stock 4.3 IPSW if you want to try to go to 4.3 you can go ahead and just click on this link on the post that will tell you how to go to 4.3 while preserving your baseband so when the dev team releases the unlock you will be able to unlock your uh, iPhone as well so basically just be sure to stay tuned and subscribe to my YouTube channel and also my website for more updates on both the untethered jailbreak and the unlock for newer baseband's I will have first coverage on both so again I hope you guys like this video please remember to rate it up let me know what you think in the comment section below and like I was saying before just make sure you subscribe until next time this is ICU signing out